This is just a quick tutorial on how to add chords or chord symbols at the top of your score like you've been asked to do. So the first thing you need to do is you'll have your score in the middle. You may have this exposed, you may not. If you haven't, just click on the three lines to the left hand side and select text. Within text you can see that we have all of these symbols here. If you can't see them and they're small like that then just push the arrow to expand. The one you're looking for is the one that says chord symbol. So when you click on that, click on the first note and you click on this, a little box appears and it, that is where you will type in the chord symbol. So this one is a G. I highly recommend you have the caps lock on because it just makes it a bit clearer. Now there is nothing on this particular second note here. If there was, I could click on it and I could put something there. But this particular one, I'm going to add chord. So again, chord. And this one is a D, and then on the next note, I can click on the note, add chord, and G. You simply continue along as you do. With this one, it's E minor, so capital E, and a little lowercase in M instead of a uppercase would be very good, because you tend to see E minor as a little lowercase M. This next note here has a chord of a D on it. Whoops, caps lock not on. Oops, caps lock still not on, caps lock on now. This one here is a G, and I believe this one might be a GC. I can't remember, I haven't got my document open. But regardless, that's how you add chords into your score on Note Flight.